The Irish players are incredibly skillful, probably up there with New Zealand, if not surpassing New Zealand now with their skill sets. Ireland's biggest thing is they've got four provinces and a lot of rugby players. The Irish team is, I would say, 70-80% uh, Leinster. And Leinster plays together in the URC, in the Champions Cup. It's not new guys that you have to bring together and have to coach every single time. I mean, half the team that will come here now, when we play them in June, will be Leinster-based players. And I think they developed so much depth and so many world-class players players in a number of positions, not just reliant on one or two guys. I think they've got 160 contracted rugby players. We have 400, 600 uh, professional rugby players. So we have the luxury that when a player struggles with a catch pass or he struggles to pass to his left, uh, you kind of work with him a little bit. If he doesn't get better, ah, oh, here's a new prodigy coming through. So we just select him and that guy's out again. So that's the first thing. They do precision farming. The pathways in Ireland are really well developed. They're really streamlined, they're really efficient. Guys come through as really complete players with really rounded skill sets. The thing that, that probably uh, struck me the most when I was in Ireland was the amount of detail that they will coach the players. A, a microscopic detail. When I was here in South Africa, before I went there, I didn't go into a tenth of the depth of detail and microscopicness that they would go into. They are maximizing all of their possible strengths. So yeah, I think that's probably why Ireland have been the best team in the world over the last two or three seasons. 